Yes, Bob. You're so desperate for love and affection. Okay. <clears throat> so today we are going to be starting more night expeditions. Oh, it's you again. This is fascinating. I was able to confirm that the onion has fused. Please keep collecting different colors of onions. I've got a lot more research to do. Okay, there's at least one more onion that I collect. I don't know how many they're going to give me. What's up? Oh, you think you've got this under control, is that it? There's two areas, dingo. I see. Well, you're not done yet. Keep at it and finish the job. Well, that's going to take me a little bit longer because I've only been to two areas now. So. Your horticultural efforts, your horticultural efforts have not gone unnoticed. The Pikmin population has bloomed thanks to you. Nice. There, there you are. The aforementioned token. That is my thanks for all your hard work. And now he wants more. Everybody just has demands. Colin, we know whose spaceship it is. You're the only person that doesn't seem to know. Keep up. All right, night expedition. Are you going to go out on a night, night expedition? Well, I'm ready when you are. These areas have been approved for night expeditions. Sun Speckled Terrace again. We can do... The higher the danger level... Okay, the danger level here isn't too high, but that doesn't mean a larger creature won't pop out and surprise you. I wonder if you can replay... Uh, I don't know who that... The blue one was. I wonder if you can replay the same area to keep getting uh, the cure, or if you can't. All right, got to move quick. Got to got to build up our Pikmin while we can. So there's something else I've figured out about the Glow Pikmin. As you can see, Glow Pikmin have been a very powerful light. You can use X to gather your Glow Pikmin until they meld together and form one large glowing ball and release them all at once and it creates a luminous and literally stunning effect, which I call a Glow Mob. One flash of that overpowering light and you'll witness all kinds of creatures cowering under its dazzling glow. Interesting information. Got another big boy coming over this way. Ooh. 
track creatures using your night radar at the bottom of your screen. Oh, I've been using that. It's very helpful. I'm kind of covering it. But this game has made me move my position so many times. Also being able to see the enemies through the... I don't know if I was supposed to be able to do that, but... guy over there do I think I have enough glow Pikmin no I don't it's getting close get away from it we've got a problem the luminol's under attack if it takes too much damage we won't get what we need get rid of them don't worry I'm on it Shouldn't have gone for that, that pile that I saw there. Nah, the trick null. That's lame. Oh, but that's everybody. Fantastic. There's not a single creature left. You put in the effort out there, new blood. All for just one. Look at the color on that. Can't make wait to make medicine with it. I'm hoping that the more difficult ones will give me more cure. It doesn't look like I get punished for, uh... For taking any damage. Good work. It looks like you're getting the hang of these night expeditions. I think you're ready. Next time you venture out, you can go wherever you'd like to collect glow sap. The search for our pilot starts in earnest now, too. Rescue as many leaflings as you can. Let's cure them all. So, about that. Let's stop and think for a hot minute here, okay? It's possible Bernard hasn't turned into a leafling yet. What do you mean? I spent a lot of time thinking about it. Yes, that leafling with the dog was chasing me, and yes, that's when I realized Bernard had disappeared, but that's all. What I'm saying is I never actually saw him turn into a leafling or anything. Oh, interesting. Then, uh, what should we... Look, at the very least, if we catch that leafling, then we might be able to get a lead on Bernard's whereabouts. I see. Okay, the search for that leafling is your top priority, Dan. Understood. Alright, that concludes this emergency meeting. Let's get to it. Now I'm gonna go to sleep, because I was up all night. You know? I wonder if uh, getting glow Pikmin counts for increasing the Pikmin population. Right. Administer the cure at once. Yes, Captain. Quick. 
Corguin. General contractor. When it comes to work, he's thorough, fast, reckless, and presumptuous, which also describes his plan to build houses here. Boss. Our work doesn't end here. It's our duty to care for and protect anyone we've rescued and hear what they have to say. I also notice that they get their helmets back when they get cured, which is kind of interesting. Well, hey. Corguin would like to speak with me. Okay. Dandori battle. Hey, thanks for the sweet rescue. I'm a general contractor over at Moyama Construction. The name's Corgwin. Just like rescuing folks, construction is all about using your imagination and Dandori powers to get the job done. I was thinking you and I could join forces and train for Dandori battles together. Let's get those imaginative juices flowing. Train for battle. Okay, now we're talking. Plus, if we do this, there's a super sweet reward in it for you, too. Hey there, the results you've had in Dandori battles are nothing to scoff at. Way to go. There's a little something just for you. Now back to the reason you're here. Let's train those Dandori muscles. <gasps> yes. Yes. Okay. I, get, I finally can redo these. This is exactly what I was looking for. I'm so happy now. All right, gathering Pikmin is the priority. I want to get that gold before he does. Doesn't look like I can. That sucks. Oh, I need those apples. Thank <laughs> you. 
Let's see, how did I do? I didn't win by 100. I don't know what the requirement to win by is, though. Gold! Damn it. Do I need to do it by 80? If I got that gold from him, that would have been big. Dare they take out Ochi. Heckin' rude. Job. Ochi is much stronger than him. And I'm doing a good job of preventing him from getting points, but I need to get more points myself. So I need to get this gold while I can. job team swiping that all from him team go I think I did much better this time around cool I won by 121 this time there we go that's what I needed there we go two platinums Exactly what I was expecting. You can replay cleared Dandori battles and Dandori challenges as many times as you'd like at the rescue command post. Well, I can't do the challenges yet, but I'm glad that I, I've, I'm finally getting there. <laughs> 
maybe the next person that I cure will give me Dandori challenges. And then I can redeem myself for having failed two challenges on the last item. Hey you, I was way impressed with your Dandori powers. Thanks. Appreciate it. You have a new item for me? Tough stuff. Air armor. Reduce overall damage. Interesting. Triple threat. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. I'm not sure I care so much about me physically doing much damage. I kind of like, uh, oh no, the puppy, the paddling was, uh, a training thing, not an item. I'm just gonna start buying things. I think at this point it doesn't really matter. I have a crap load of money. Okay. Uh, we'll do a hot. We'll do this one too. All right. And the, the whole the whole plan is to to get them all at the end. At some point, anyway. All right, let's do one more night expedition, and this will be the last thing for the night. All right, one more area here, meandering slope. Let's do it. It's hard to, like, um, monitor and protect multiple different things because the enemies seem to be able to come from lots of different directions. Come in. Can you hear me, Dan? A while back, I taught Ochi a particular skill used for operations that involved protecting a client. Select the luminal you want Ochi to protect, and then give him the command. Ochi will patrol near the luminal and bite any creatures that come close. During a night expedition, if he gets separated from your squad, he'll go to that spot and patrol it for you. Work with him to protect the luminal. That's useful. Alright. Uh, wrong button. Command Ochi to protect the blue luminal. We're just gonna not fo worry about that right now. When you keep saying things like, oh, protect the luminal, you make it sound like it's under attack.
Can you guys go? I feel like the luminal's about to get attacked. The music is getting intense. Okay, I think that's uh, I think that's all the enemies. Nah. Fantastic. There's not a single creature left standing or skittering. Or hopping. Gonna give me more than one because it was a double danger. Lame. Alright then, go collect that glow sap. I still don't know if I can replay like areas already and get more glow sap. I still probably want to beat each of the individual night missions though. My observations have led me to an important realization. Glow Pikmin cannot die. What? How? What do you mean? Well, when a Glow Pikmin uh, meets its demise, it turns into photons and returns to the luminal, or so it seems. So are they really Pikmin then? Good question. They act like it. Although the lo it's a luminal instead of an onion, which is weird. Right. Administer the cure at once. Please be the person that lets me redo Dandori challenges. He's always in search of the next uncharted planet to explore, as well as someone who wants to hear tales of his past adventures. He's got a he's got a clock icon next to Space Explorer, so I'm hoping. Our work doesn't end here. It's our duty to care for and protect anyone. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yeah. Hello there, Jin. You're the one who saved me. Thank you. I will never forget your kindness. My name is Jin. I am an adventurer wandering the universe in search of uncharted lands. Adventurers never skip their training. You can do most anything as long as you can rely on your physical self. Which brings me to another important aspect of Dandori challenge training. Meditation. Why don't you give it a try? If you can visualize your Dandori well, I will present you with a small reward. I see you're able to visualize well. You really do have remarkable potential. Nice. Nice. This is life. Please take that. Continue to work hard and keep up with your training. There we go. I can get my, uh... I can get my, uh, redemption on these two missions next time. Literally the last item for both of them. So that's like the first thing I'm going to do next time I stream is do that. Hello. 
Wow, thanks a ton. You bloomed a whole lot of flowers. They're so beautiful. Nice. But you can't really be done, right? This world needs more flowers. Keep blooming. You gotta keep blooming. I wonder if that's like an endless mission. But with the fact that enemies don't respawn on the on the surface, it gets a little odd. I guess we'll see what ends up happening. Who is the like l big blue survivor? When I take off, there's like a broad-shouldered, blue-haired survivor that I don't recognize. Is it you? Oh, it is you. Okay, never mind. Uh, question asked and answered. So we have to do two more night expeditions to get those two guys. And we got those Dandori challenges. Ah, oh, I'm excited. <laughs> Alright, uh, save and return to title. 